we need to put a short fiber on the machine and you can see that the length is the left vigorous and the right vigorous length is okay do not press by the fiber holder okay so make the short fibers on the vigorous and you can see that the fiber interface will not pressed by the fiber holder, left and right one is the same. Close it. So you can see the fiber is a little lower because the uh, uh, cross icon is a little higher of the fiber center. And it's also a little lower than the cross icon. This is what we need to adjust. The first thing is to dismantle the machine power off the machine and eject the battery this battery out then take the, this one out so maybe this is the AI9 optic module and you can unscrew the screws and then pull it out then the should be to dismantle the shell is
So if you are AI9, AI9, you can directly charge here, charge here, charge here. The, the power the power port you can charge here and the machine can directly power on. And because this is uh, AI7C, AI7C need we charge about these parts. Charge it and make sure you connect the right way and charge it. Charge it OK so that you can keep this state. Keep this state so you can see the CMOS. This is CMOS module, and there you can see four screws, right? This is the lens module. and Make sure the lens module firmly firmly mount on the machine core. Firmly mount on the machine core. And what we need to adjust is the CMOS board. CMOS board is okay. And the same way you can see that here, here there is also a CMOS board. And when you check about it, you can keep the power adapter on. Can you see that? Keep the power adapter on. So press it. Press the start button. You can see the screen display it right. And uh, take take it carefully because there is a short fiber on it. Open it, close it, right. So we can see the fiber right here. And then what should we do is to adjust the CMOS board, make it a little higher in the let the cross icon in the middle of the fiber. So use the screws. You can see that the CMOS board there are two screws. You can loosen a little, not fully loosen a little. Okay, losing little is okay. You can see the CMOS board is can moving and shaking, and you can see that the screws. It will show you that, right? So when you take CMOS higher, make it close to the heating oven. You can see that the fiber will be more higher. And when you try your best, icon is nearly the fiber center. You can keep it. So you hold on this state, hold on this state, and use the screws. Check again. In the middle of it, it's right. And tighten the screws. It will be a little difficult for you because the, the space is a little narrow. Okay, we tighten it. You can see that oh, the fiber is a little lower again, and we need to do it again and again. It will cost you. It will cost you a lot of time. It will cost you a lot of time. So keep this state and loosen a little. Loosen a little. Do not fully loosen it, okay? Using a little, then see the screens. See the screens. 
Yeah, so from my view, which of you clearly see it, and you can see this. Okay, this this is a good position. You can one hand pull it out, and then that and other hand can tighten the screws. It's really easy for you to to do this job and make sure the fiber is in the middle. This will cost you, cost you a lot of time. Okay, so you can see the fiber is more in the cross of the line, and it's it's also in the middle. So the same way, adjust the adjust the x side, then adjust the y side. Adjust y side. You can put it put it like this. Put it like this and loosen it. You can see from the right side, from the screen, adjust it, then make it in the middle. So it's the first thing, and nearly make the cross icon in the middle is okay. So it's very close to the center, it's, it's okay. And these two sides, we adjust good. And this is the first step. So, 